This story is sponsored by Robinson Community College. Excited to be here at Robinson Community College. I have Mr. Tim Bryant with me, the instructor for the heating and air conditioning program here. How are you? I'm doing great. Awesome. So tell me about your program. The program here at Robinson Community College is actually a two-year program. Before last year, it was a one-year program. So we actually, uh, this is the second uh, year of a two-year program. It's designed to actually, uh, students will come in and it's, it's teaching them how to actually, everything it is about a heat and air conditioning system. From refrigeration, uh, air distribution, um, con controls, and troubleshooting. Interesting. So talk about what the program entails, maybe the course curriculum. It's broken down in different classes. Uh, we start off with refrigeration. Refrigeration is actually the, uh, the ref refrigeration seal system side of the system, putting Freon in, when to put it in, how to read gauges, and then they'll leave, uh, leave that class and go into more of the electrical part. Uh, the devices that actually controls the, uh, the air condition beyond the thermostat where most uh, customers are looking at. And right now, I have actually talked to the industry and they're actually working around the schedule of my second year students. Uh, uh, the last semester, they have a very light load, so uh, they'll leave at 12 o'clock and then uh, uh, they can actually go to work then. Wonderful. Yeah. I love that. And mm -hmm. I love how you all are involved with them actually finding a job mm -hmm. after paying for yeah. education, you know, in this aspect. Okay. So, Mr. Brian, I am excited to learn today okay. about what they're doing. Tell me about uh, just this exercise that they're doing today. Uh, right now, they have boards in front of them. And on the boards, you got heat and air condition uh, components. Okay. All, the, all the components on the board mm -hmm. is actually what you will find in the heat and air condition system, uh, like your transformer, sequencers, and relays. Okay. Uh, all these components are found inside the system. You got the uh, temperature switch. So in this exercise, we actually uh, it's designed to uh, get the students familiar with uh, uh, how the components work. Okay, uh, they know that if you get voltage to this transformer, it's going to produce 24 volts. And the reason why it's going to produce 24 volts because it's safe for the homeowner. You don't want to go to a thermostat and there's 120 volts at the thermostat, so we actually uh, downsize the voltage so it can be safe for the homeowner. And uh, in this exercise, I come up with a sequence operation. And what we got is three light bulbs. And I want light bulb one to come on a, de a delay. And when it shuts off, the second light bulb comes on. Then the, it shuts off and the third light bulb come on. Then it starts back over again. And they're using their own schematic and they're using all the same components. The apprenticeship program is a, it's basically it's an agreement between the college, the employer, and the state of North Carolina with the North Carolina Apprenticeship uh, Program through the community colleges. It is a, anywhere from a two to a five year program. Uh, usually it aligns itself with a particular program that we teach at the college and again with the industry nearby. So for example, one of our biggest ones is with Campbell's Soup and our industrial maintenance. So these students would uh, get their education, learn their fundamentals and, ba and basics at RCC. They also would work part-time, get paid for it at, at uh, Campbell's Soup, mm -hmm. learn the hands-on and what's particular about that type of manufacturing. So they get to develop those really finite and, and uh, technical skills that we may not be able to teach at the college. So I'm here with Melinda and she is a part of the electrical systems program. Mm -hmm. Well tell me about this amazing beastie piece of equipment. <laughs> <laughs> so it's actually a remote controlled yeah. lawnmower. Yeah, a remote control lawnmower. Apprenticeship program really gives you an opportunity to get real work experience. With the apprenticeship and school, I'm able to work and get my hands-on experience there. 